coffee. It's a pronounced gift. I like window seats. But if the window breaks, you get sucked out. Hybrid, plug-in hybrid, EV. To each their own, electric. Get offers on select vehicles at the Lexus Golden Opportunity sales event. Get special offers on select Lexus models. This July at Saboba Casino Resort. Blast off every Friday and Saturday on a journey to the planet Moolah. Win your share of up to $485,000 in cash and prizes. And on July 29th at 11 p.m., you could win a 2024 BMW M440i convertible. Earn entries daily with your Saboba Rewards card and explore the Milky Way on a journey to the planet Moolah. Saboba Casino Resort. Thinking about selling your home in today's more challenging market? Well, you don't have to let it sit for weeks or months trying to sell it the traditional way. It's 72 sold. You For over 35 years, my mission has been to deliver more for our clients, to deliver more for you. If you or anyone in your family has been injured in a car accident, call us now as the time to file a claim may be limited. Last year, more clients hired Morgan & Morgan than ever before. Protecting America, fighting for you, Morgan & Morgan. The Summer Savings Event is going on right now at Mathis Home. This seven piece dining set is just $5.65. That's right, get all seven pieces for only $5.65. Or shop this counter height marble top table for only $7.96. And this double pedestal dining table from Ashley is only $6.83. Shop great values like these on hundreds of dining sets during the summer savings event at Mathis Home. Meet a doctor who connects all the dots. Oftentimes, people with low back pain, knee pain, or hip pain don't even recognize that it's actually coming from their feet. Their feet? For real? Absolutely, 100%. It can have a domino effect because their foot and their ankle aren't supported properly. Their whole body is out of whack. Getting back into whack? Good feet arch supports could help. Keeping your body in good alignment, that can go a long way. Come in for your free fitting at the Good Feet Store. Now at 5.30, the search for a hit-and-run driver in South L.A. last night. An 85-year-old grandfather and his grandson were crossing the street when they were hit by a car. The grandfather died. The grandson is still in the hospital this evening. NBC4's Macy Jenkins joins us live from the neighborhood right now where it all happened. She spoke to the family today. Macy? Hi, Annabelle and Colleen. Yeah, that 85-year-old grandfather and his adult grandson were crossing the street right here in this neighborhood when they were struck last night. The grandson still in the ICU over at Cedars fighting for his life. Investigators now looking for video of what happened last night to find the driver who witnesses say kept driving after the collision. A granddaughter distraught over the loss of her 85-year-old grandfather, Marco Tulio Santizo, struck and killed in a hit-and-run Thursday night in Crenshaw. He raised me. My mom left us with my dad and with my grandma and my grandpa, so they raised us. LAFD got the call around 9.30 p.m., saying two pedestrians had been hit by a dark-colored car on Santa Rosalia Drive, about eight blocks west of the Baldwin Hills Crenshaw Mall. Witnesses told police the driver took off without stopping. I just passed by and I happened to thought it was a paper bag or something. And I said, where are the people? And I made a U-turn and just came right here because there's nobody out here. The two people hit 85-year-old Santizo and his 41-year-old grandson, Marco Tulio Herrera, Mayra Arias' brother. She told NBC4 she was inside of the family's apartment when she heard a loud crash outside, but didn't realize what had happened until police knocked on her door. My brother, he flew from there to here. Imagine this. Both were taken to the hospital. The 85-year-old later pronounced dead, while Herrera remains in the ICU with severe injuries. It's my papito and my hermano. You have no idea how much pain the whole family has. It's frustrating, painful. Sad. Mayra's husband, Walter Arias, says the two were on their way home after work. We're hard workers. We 
Everything we do is work uh, and taking care of the family. Mayra now blaming herself for using the family's parking space last night, forcing Santizo and Herrera to park across the street. Not park there so they could park there and we'll be okay now. He'll be here. <laughs> Now, police have little information about the driver, only that he was driving a dark-colored car. The city is offering a reward of up to $50,000 for anyone who can provide information leading to an arrest or conviction of the driver. Reporting live in Crenshaw, Macy Jenkins, NBC4 News. What a tragedy. Thank you, Macy. Meantime, new at five, the man convicted of setting up a smuggling trip that killed 13 people near the California-Mexico border has been sentenced to 15 years in prison. The crash happened March 2nd, 2021 near Hotville. 